Dude. <sighs> Welcome back to a brand new video. I thought, since we're on the mechanical keyboard section of 60 percenters, why not show you guys how to actually fix one that's not a high ground spec, because obviously a high ground spec, you have the instruction manual, so you can literally reset everything, change the modes, and not have confusion. Well, today, I'm gonna show you exactly how to fix a keyboard that maybe somehow just change the RGB on you, let alone change the keys to where they're not even registering as the keys and or anything else. So we're gonna do a whole factory reset. So this is the $40, 60% keyboard that I bought off of Amazon. So we're gonna try it. So the main issues that I'm having currently is that my 60% keyboard will not display an I, O, or a Y. So basically the top three buttons that are next to the most important ones, especially for my key binds, because I have E and I have R. So without further ado, this is actually how you reset your 60% keyboard. Now this isn't for all of them, but this is mostly for a majority of them. Since I already reset mine, this is literally all you do. You have your FN key, which is your function key, and then you have your space bar. If you want a factory reset to fully reset what your keyboard looked like as soon as you plugged it in, press and hold the FN key or the function button, and press and hold your space bar, and press and hold it for three seconds. I kid you not, it was that easy. This video was super short too, but uh, this is how you fix your 60% keyboard. If it ever somehow changes the RGB on you, if it somehow changes the keybinds on you, if it somehow changes really just about anything on you. So, this is how. And with using this information, I hope you hit that subscribe button. It's free. And I will see you guys in my next video. Peace.